from Nico's stream. I was able to get one good shot of her foot. Bro, get help, please. Yep, this dude definitely needs some help. What's going on, Mother Chodes? It's your boy Long Nail back again with another new video. And in today's video, we're going over the hot posts from r slash cringetopia. Let's get into it. Mom demands babysitter pay hundreds for emotions caused after feeding kids nuggets. What? Nuggets? No! Ivanka blamed a fart on her classmates when she was a teenager. Okay, but why is this newsworthy? Isn't there anything better we could be going over in the news than this? For real? Hello? Huh? Don't huh me. If you talk to my girlfriend like that ever again, you'll get to see the demon inside me. Don't mess with me. I'll ruin you. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're normal, mate. Reveals teeth, showing four big fangs. What are you laughing at, little boy? Oh, bro. Oh, this is just over the top. I guess if the dude was talking to your chick and you didn't like it, address it. But like this? Oh, bro. Bro. When the nice guy gets tired of being mistreated, that's when society should be afraid. Because that's when he'll make an edgy statement with the Joker picture and then get back to doing nothing. <laughs> yeah, basically sums up r slash nice guys pretty well. That whole subreddit is pretty cringe, so I'd say this fits. Amy Schumer pranks Kanye and Kim by falling over and pretending to pass out. Kanye reacts by just walking away. Oh no, that's even worse than like throwing out a joke and it just doesn't hit and then you're sitting there in awkward silence. Yeah, this is that times 10. Yellow dye is applied to this eye to fully see a paper cut. Yep, that's something I definitely never needed to see, but definitely makes me cringe a little. I feel like there's gotta be a better way to see a paper cut than putting all of this stuff in their eye? And how do you get a paper cut on your eye in the first place? Like, oh no, this is just bad on top of bad. The guys that do this, Simp Patrol. Um, no, this is just a dude going through the mall with his sister. And even if it was his girlfriend, that doesn't mean he's a simp. You realize the people that are simping are like the dude from the first post on this subreddit versus dudes with just a girlfriend. Like you could have a girlfriend and not be a simp. What you can't do is snap the one frame from a, a live stream where your favorite streamer shows part of their foot. Yeah, that's a simp. Just having a girlfriend, not a simp. Since YouTube isn't making a rewind this year, I'm going to. Who gave you the authority, white man? Uh. That's the thing. He doesn't need the authority from anybody. If he wants to make a video, he can make it. And honestly, I'd say it's a good call by YouTube to not make the rewind this year because isn't it like one of the most disliked videos on YouTube ever for two years in a row? Yeah, I can only imagine what this year would bring. Good call, YouTube. Good call. Men's heartbreak is so funny because nine out of 10 times, it's their own fault. Now you're wrong and upset. Uh, bold of you to say nine out of 10 times, it's their own fault. I'd say it's probably a lot closer to 50-50. And why would you be happy about anybody's heartbreak and try to make a whole post just rubbing it in their face? that you think it's happy that they're not feeling good right now. You're basically just a scumbag. Sometimes an eyelash gets into the eye. You blink and it disappears. But where did they go? Oh, oh man, what if this was actually the case? Like obviously this doesn't happen, but if it did, um, wow, the itchiness. Just imagine the itchiness behind your eye. Oh. That's a weird thing to try to feel. Ladies and lads, what are some music red flags? For example, Radiohead, Slow Dive, The Smiths, 
male manipulator music, if you will. Uh, what? I feel like you've met a couple of guys who are slightly manipulative and also happen to like this, and now you're trying to associate that with all men out there, which definitely isn't a fair thing to do. I think just associating anybody with a certain thing solely based on the music they listen to probably isn't a good thing. And for the most part, you're probably wrong. All right, Modern Chodes, that's it for the hot posts from r slash cringetopia. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications. And of course, share this video with your friends. Till next time, peace.